Have you ever been told you're just trying too hard? Don't do that. You're trying too hard. I've been told that and it is an annoying statement to hear. So stay tuned to this video if you ever heard that and I'll teach you how to deal with it. My name is Cyrus Asar and my mission is to embody the emotion of overcoming. I believe we all fight battles we hide from the world. My objective is to help you win those battles through perspective. Stay tuned. Have you ever heard, you just trying too hard? I hate hearing that statement. I don't even like using the word hate, but I don't like the results of me not trying my hardest. When somebody is saying you trying too hard about whatever it may be, what can happen when you change to adjust is insecurities. Because how can you gauge what's trying too hard and what's not based on somebody else's opinion? Well, you trying too hard, whether it's trying to date somebody, you trying too hard. No, you being yourself. If you open up to this person, you telling them exactly who you are and they can't see the value in it, then it's okay to walk away from it. I know at times we want this person so bad that we willing to compromise our character for that person or that job or whatever it is, we willing to compromise our character to get it. And then we end up losing in the end when they don't accept it. And then we feel like, dang, I didn't even show them our true side. I didn't even show them myself. I didn't show them my true personality because I was trying to overcompensate or undercompensate based on what somebody else told me about me trying too hard. No, stay true to yourself. Under all circumstances, stay true to yourself. There's no such thing as trying too hard. It's a such thing as you being yourself and these people can recognize it or these people cannot. I never liked the results of me not trying my best. So don't let nobody get in your head and tell you, you know what, you know, you don't need to go as hard or you know what, you don't need to do this or you don't need to do that because what can seep into your mind is insecurities and what can seep into your mind is you not trying your best on other things as well. Whether, like I said, whether you're trying to hook up with somebody or whether you want to get this job or whether you want to do whatever, somebody can try and pull you back saying, you know what, you're trying too hard. That's because it may be an adjustment for them that they can't deal with. That's fine. They're not used to somebody going all out. That's, that can be uncomfortable. If somebody is used to people cutting corners around them all the time, whether it is a relationship, whether it is a job, whether it is whatever, you at your job and you going hard, other people that cut corners be like, wait a minute, slow down. Don't get all that work done because then they're going to look at me and tell me that I got to catch up. That's what happens. Same thing, with, like I said, with a relationship. You might be going hard at somebody and they're going to wait, slow down because they ain't used to another, another person doing nothing for them. So the fact you start doing stuff, they're like, wait a minute, this is, I'm not used to this. So what they tell you in return is you got to stop trying so hard. Same thing at a job. You know what? You got to stop trying so hard. No matter what it is, you know what? You gotta, you're the problem now because you're trying your hardest. You can't let that seep into your mind because what will happen, as I said, is you'll start becoming insecure about your effort into things. Well, what is trying hard? What is cutting back? No, don't second guess that. Don't even let it seep into your brain whatsoever whatsoever trust me this is the type of message where people that slack off do not want you to really hear it because it's going to make them feel uncomfortable when you're in this environment constantly going your hardest this happens constantly constantly people that cut corners do not want you to do things the right way they want you to cut corners as well so we can all cut corners but the fact that you like know what i'm going my hardest now you're trying too hard. They're trying to get in your mind to make you change your habits. But you know what happens when you cut corners on things that you like to do or you don't like to do? It starts seeping into everything else. Anytime you start cutting corners, it starts seeping into everything else. So don't look at it like that. Don't cut no corners because somebody else is trying to make you feel insecure about trying your hardest. I don't care if it's somebody you want to date. I don't care if it's a job. I don't care what it is. You cannot listen to somebody else tell you that you're trying too hard in your life being an authentic version of yourself. 
because it will have you second guessing yourself if you believe it. Before you know it, you don't even know who you are no more. You don't know when to try your hardest, when to ease up, when to do anything. Just stay true to yourself. And that's all that matters. That's what always matters. Stay true to yourself. If you're one of those people that go all out, continue to go all out. And if people don't like it, that's fine. That's on them. But don't compromise your character because of the judgment of somebody else that can't see that you're one of those people that like working hard. You know what I'm saying? If you like this video, please comment, subscribe, share it. If you know anybody that can relate to it, definitely share it. If you know somebody that has told you that you try too hard, send this to them. Maybe they may understand your perspective. I look forward to the comments. I look forward to writing back. Thank you.